deal with it. Oh, oh my god. Did, did you get that? <laughs> yeah. There's one down here. Oh my giddy I don't know what to do. Erwin! Erwin! Oh my god! You know, you know, you know, you know. Laney and Ben's home is plagued by unrelenting poltergeists, and there is no escaping their haunting presence. Despite not having to deal with it themselves, the couple has plenty of paranormal footage to prove their claims. Why do I always have to be the one? Like, it's like I'm the sacrificial lamb. Literally? Well, I don't want to have to be the one to deal with it. Oh my god. Did you get that? <laughs> yeah. The evidence is undeniable, and it's clear that a malevolent poltergeist with a twisted sense of humor is at play. It's a situation that is both unsettling and dangerous. Look. Nobody in here. Beware of the friendly looking woodland folk, for they are not as innocent as they seem. It's more down here. YouTuber Owen Saunders stumbled upon these mischievous creatures during his journey into the forest. As they explored the area, they discovered a strange garland wrapped around a tree trunk, and soon after, they spotted one of the little creatures observing them. The situation took a terrifying turn when the creature was caught stealing a felt doll from Carol's back. Although Carol appeared unperturbed, the encounter left Erwin and his team shaken. Who knows what other sinister plans these woodland creatures have in store for unsuspecting travelers. That's the one I saw down there just now. It's the same one. It's the same one. Oh my gosh. Beware. An unknown presence lurks in the room. Quick, lock your doors and stay alert. The latest video by Fourth Wall will send shivers down your spine as you watch a seemingly harmless cat, oblivious to the sinister figure lurking behind the door. Is it just a figment of your imagination, or is something truly lurking in the shadows? The second video offers no respite, as the mystery deepens, leaving you to wonder what is truly lurking in the room with them. As the YouTube team from Amy's Crypt explores the demonic Sally house, they uncover terrifying answers. In the basement, they place their paranormal devices on the spot, and it confirms the rumors are true. But as they investigate one of the bedrooms, the spirits make a request to play with Sally. Suddenly, the automated toy speaks up with an absolutely creepy outburst. Using a spirit box, they communicate with the spirits who warn them to stay. Yeah. Oh, I would love oh. to play with you. The next room is Sally's room. Was this a kid's room too? Did she have a brother or something? I have heard that there are other children to be sighted here. It's not just Sally. Then, they hear a noise. Oh. And the REM pod goes off. The spirit continues to speak validating its presence and leaving the team wondering if it knows their names. They feel a sense of impending danger and realize they must leave soon if they don't want Sally to attach to them forever. What color is the light on the floor? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. In the eerie silence of the cemetery, a child's voice beckons the cameraman to follow him. With trembling steps, they move forward, only to be met with a spine-chilling sight. 
Who keeps throwing the flowers? Uy. ¿Dónde estás? And for what sinister purpose? No, 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 no. Las está aventando, Clary, las está aventando. As the child continues to lead them on, a sense of dread settles over them. ¿Dónde estás? Quiero que te manifiestes. ¿Y no? ¿Y eso no salió? Niño, ¿qué es lo que necesitas? Is this just a game to the child? ¿Dónde cayó? ¡Mira, mira, 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 mira! ¡Mira que se levantó! ¡Mira que se levantó! ¡Mira que se levantó! ¡Aquí, mira que se levantó! ¡Sí lo alcancé a grabar! ¡Sí lo alcancé a grabar! ¡Se levantó esta, Clary! ¡Se levantó esta! Or something far more sinister? The memory of this haunting encounter will never leave their mind. The curtains. Feathers. Feathers. What does that mean?